Hi, uh, this experiment is about Wheatstone Bridge. Here, um, this circuit, we have four resistors R1, R2, R3, R4. Initially, we are starting it with 22 ohm resistor, which is this is R1, R2, R3, and R4. And in this circuit, um, this point is called A, this is our B, and this is our C, and this is our D. From point A, um, our input positive supply is being given. From point C, our input negative supply is given. This positive and negative supply is of 5 volts and it is from our mind act device using jumper wire. In our circuit, the voltage difference V0 is being sensed using mind act. Um, the data is being transferred using this jumper wire from D and B which is being connected to probe, sensing probe using banana jack. Uh, this is a given circuit. Based on this circuit, we, are, we have built this, our, our, our circuit. So, this app is a part of my DAC which has been used by us for measuring exciting voltages uh, which gives our result in DC DC current okay. these are the different resistors which ranges from 22R to 100K ohm these resistors are being used in the place of R3 this circuit is not closed yet so we are gonna close this circuit as per Wheatstone concept if we close this circuit uh, we should get 0 volt since we are the 4 resistor which we have been using is 22R so there won't be any voltage difference and as per the concept we are getting 0 volt as a result from that app now we are gonna change R3 we are gonna change uh, replace 22R with 47R so that okay video of change now R3 is been replaced from 22R to 47R now there will be a voltage difference between D and B which is our V0 this difference will be shown in um, given my depth act so that difference V0 is 0 0.79 volt so there is some fluctuation and so it is now the reading is now scott stable at 0 0.79 and we are going to take the, this as our reading so meanwhile we have taken some readings for 47 or 100 or so so this is our experimental values and this is our theoretical values which we have pre-calculated it so we are going to extend this calculation till 100k resistor and we are going to compare our experimental values with theoretical values. Thank you.